All right, so in our last uh, project, we looked at how you can access the pixels of an image to make cool filters, to um, you know, do really cool stuff with that. And this project is going to extend those ideas into a field called computer vision. Computer vision is all about taking those pixels and extracting information, um, useful things from uh, frames of video, still photos, and stuff like that. Um, and so we're gonna use our webcam as an input and over the course of these demos, look at a bunch of cool ways that we can track stuff um, using some really simple things, using just JavaScript, all the way to really fancy um, AI and machine learning systems that allow us to do some really amazing things just with the pixels from our webcam. Um, but before we dive into all that stuff, we should look at how do we even get the webcam plugged in and displayed with B5.js. And luckily it's really, really easy. Um, so I have just a basic sketch set up here. Um, and we just need to make a variable for our webcam. We can call this whatever we want. And then in setup, um, it's as easy as saying create capture. And this will be video. And I mean, that's really it. We, we're gonna add a couple extra things here. Um, the first is I'm gonna set the size of the camera input. Um, and this is uh, really useful. We'll see in a little while for making sure that you've got the right sort of like resolution. Uh, so I'm gonna say video.size is 640 by 480. And then to display the video in draw, we just use the image command. So we say video and at zero, zero. Now I'm using browser sync here uh, with an external editor. And I think you're gonna want to do that for most of these examples. You'll notice that my video doesn't show up. And the reason is that I'm not um, highlighted on my browser. And this is like a security feature. So you'll notice the minute I click over here, all of a sudden my webcam shows up and I'm mirrored, which is kind of funny, uh, but it's, it's that easy. It's, it's super simple. Um, now there's one other funny thing you'll notice here, and that's um, there's two videos and you might be thinking, why is this? Um, well, the reason is the way that the video capture works, it actually creates a HTML video object in our page and, um, and works through that, but we don't wanna see that. We just wanna display it within our canvas. So essentially we're drawing it twice. So I'm just gonna say video dot hide, and that's actually just gonna remove that element. And now we should be just seeing our, there we go, uh, seeing our webcam input right here. And that's it, it's super easy. Um, in the next video, we'll look at how you can access the pixels from the webcam and then extend this further into cool kinds of tracking and stuff like that.